After an impressive start to the campaign, Caen have run out of steam a little bit in recent weeks. They came into Saturday's game against Ganga on the back of three defeats against Lyon and Toulouse in the league and against Monaco in the League Cup on Tuesday. With just one point from their last four games, Patrice Garon said have slipped from sixth down to ninth. Ganga, on the other hand, have recovered from a poor start to the season. They came into this one just a point behind Caen in the table. The Brittany side, sixth at this stage last term, claiming back-to-back -back league wins for the first time in over a year after edging Troyes and then thrashing at 10-man Dijon. So a clash of two reasonably ambitious sides determined to secure a top-half finish in Ligue 1 Conferama this season. And Ronnie Rodland really should have given Con the lead midway through the first half. Somehow failing to hit the target there after the ball across from Jordan Encololo. Huge let-off for the visitors. Well, getting goals hasn't been Con's strong suit this season. They've only managed 11 in 17 games so far. That's the second worst scoring record in Liga and Conferrama. Only three of their players have been on target. Rodlan, Damian De Silva and top scorer Ivan Santini. They have been a bit unlucky in recent weeks with efforts coming back off the woodwork. Either way, goalless at half-time. And the poor state of the pitch at the stand at Michel Donano. Not exactly helping matters. The supporters at least keeping up their spirits in the Normandy rain. Con coming forward again early in the second half. Some more good work from Encololo. And Santini denied by an excellent reflex save there from Carl Joanne Johnson. Mustafa Diallo then had a spectacular effort for Gangon. The midfielder trying his luck from distance, and it required a superb save from Remy Vakutra. Yanis Saliba was the next man to try his luck as Gangon up the tempo a little in the second half. Another good save from Vakutra. The former Leon man. But the goals that simply wouldn't come for either side. Patrice Garon's men getting forward again. Late in the half, Vincent Bessa looking to get a ball across for Christian Kouaku. Excellently blocked by Pedro Rubacho. Gangon keeping a fourth consecutive clean sheet, which is the best current run in Liga. As it finished 0-0, Caen a tenth, a point ahead of Gangon in 12th. 